It started back with the Apex Corporation in the 70s, and the birth of Silicon River in North Korea. Even back then, their tech was way ahead of what was coming out of America. We bought everything they could sell, from phones to tablets to just about anything. And when they started making weapons, well, we couldn't resist. Our wars in the Middle East had been getting worse and worse, one leading straight to the next. Even after that terrible day in Riyadh, we kept fighting as our country fell apart. And still, we bought Apex to give us an edge. As the dollar tanked, our debt to North Korea spiraled. Unemployment rocketed, and the country was on its knees. The failing government defaulted on the debt, and the North Koreans made their decision. Every piece of technology they'd sold us had a back door. They turned off our military with a single button press. The first KPA troops on U.S. soil were said to be there to rebuild. But after the early aid packages, there was only brutality. They stole our liberty and our freedom. America is under control of the KPA. But she will rise again. You are the revolution. Hello and welcome to KAC, I'm Su Bing Kang. Today's top story, preparations begin today for the much anticipated Patriot's Day Parade. This auspicious calendar event celebrates the contribution of the liaison officers who work tirelessly to bridge the gap between the emergency administration and the ordinary citizens. To ensure the safety of the citizens during the parade, Mayor Simpson has vowed to redouble anti-terrorist efforts and has allocated additional peacekeeper resources to tackle any and all criminal activity in the lead-up to the parade. Mayor Simpson has just released the following statement. We all know only too well the threats we face daily here in Philadelphia. The bombings, the shootings, all orchestrated by Benjamin Walker's National Network of Terror. Rest assured, we will bring these criminals to justice. Peacekeeper patrols keep our streets safe and secure for all citizens. Thanks to improved threat recognition systems in our drones, potential off, terrorists please. can be identified and neutralized swiftly. That fucking guy. He calls us terrorists? After what he's done? He wouldn't be so confident if he knew Walker was right here in Philly. Yeah. Walker's really gonna stir things up. How long till he's due? Five minutes. Hope one of those new drones doesn't scan him. Are we ready? I think so. Something, eh, Brady? Only been, what, uh, three days with us? And you're gonna meet Walker in person? He's the whole reason I'm here. He's inspired all of us. Brady, can you pass me some gas? Thanks. I guess Walker was a legend in Washington, too, huh? I heard a little about what happened there. I'm sorry, I'm glad you're here with us Hey, now. guys, there's something weird. The street's deserted. What? Shit, is it us? Fuck, Walker's gonna be here any minute! We don't tell him nothing, Brady. You hear? Hello. Thank you for waiting so patiently. We can get started now. So, you are gonna tell me where I can find Benjamin Walker. You're wasting your time here. The last thing I heard, Walker was down in Memphis. You know I have superpowers. Fuck your powers, you pathetic little traitor. 
Oh, sounds like someone needs a demonstration. I'll show you exactly how powerful I am. I take my hand like this. I point. Mary. And... Do it, you son of a bitch! No! 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 Hey, that's something. So, how about it? Are you ready to talk now? Huh? I'll tell you. I'm getting tired of your bullshit! Start talking! I won't go so easy on you. This is the place. She'll be safe here for now. You've got to make contact with another resistance cell. Shot. This phone is our ticket to safety. If you can find a network transceiver and hack into it, that'll connect us to the hidden resistance signal and show us the closest safe house. Here, take it. We're working blind here. You need to find a resistance stash. That should have intel on the district, including transceiver locations. But hurry, Brady. We don't have long.
This changes oh nothing. God. Walk, you hear me? Shit, they got Others walk. will rise up. You can't stop. Ah! Get the fuck off me! Get the fuck off! Did you see something? Oh my God, I can't believe it. They got him. Traitor, trying to sell us out to the Norks for a handful of rice, yeah? 
Let's teach him a lesson. I'll go first. Easy, Bakes. Dana said we caught anyone, we gotta tell her first. You don't want to piss her off, do you? Well, I just hope she leaves a piece for me. I wouldn't count on it. I don't think I'll be seeing you again. <sighs> Heavy fuck, huh? Be a bit lighter once Dana's finished with him. Yeah. <laughs> down there. I'm Dana. And you are Mr. Spy. You and I are gonna play a game. You're gonna tell me what the Norks know about us, and I'm gonna hurt you while you do it. This game will be a lot more fun for me than you, I'm afraid. The question is, will it be quick? Or will it be Really? Really? Slow. Just scream as loud as you want, okay? No need to suffer in silence. Okay. Nipples first, I think. Hey, Dana. I hear we got company. Who is he? Oh, uh, just another spy. I'm gonna ask him a few questions. How do you know he's a spy? Well, that's what Baker and Skizari said. Those two? Dana, they're dumb as shit. You got anything on him? Say, pal. You got some ID? You got here. Ethan Brady. I knew it. Walker's message said he was coming in with this guy. Well, no one told me. Yeah, well, if I could ever find you when I need you. Mm. You'd only just joined Harvey's crew, right? I'm sorry about what happened, but you survived. We could use a guy like you. I'm Jack Parrish, by the way. This is Doc Sam Burnett, and, uh... Dana Moore, you meant no hard feelings, I hope. You're a lucky boy. You okay, kid? Looks like some head trauma. Possible concussion. I got some pills you should take. Hey, Doc, you don't need to open up. He needs to keep his focus. Head injuries can be unpredictable. You feeling confused, kid? Disconnected? He's fine, Doc. You know what's real, don't you, Brady? Looks like he's been through a lot. Last thing he needs is more trouble. Can't you fix him up a new ID and let him go? It's not that easy, Doc. You saw the screens. The Norks want this guy bad. Besides, we need people like him. Ain't afraid to take a chance. And he's seen too much already. Yeah. So, what do you say, Brady? You're gonna stick with us, huh? It ain't gonna be glamorous. And you're probably gonna die. Ah! Speeches like that! I'm amazed we haven't won the war already. Yeah, well, that's why we need Walker, huh? Words ain't my specialty. So, any objections to Brady joining us? Yeah. No? Sweet. Well, if no one's gonna listen to me, I'll be getting back to my work. Good luck, kid. Go on, Doc. All right. As soon as we get word where they're holding Walker, we gotta find a way to bust them out. Everything depends on him. But first things first, we're gonna get you trained up and show you how we do things around here. I'm heading out. Got that transceiver to take care of. See ya. Walker. Well, it's good you came along when you did, Brady. Walker must have seen potential in you. I don't know if he trusted you. My instincts tell me you're all right. And we need more people like you. People willing to join the uprising. That's what it's all about now. We gotta stir the people up, and soon enough we'll be snowballing. Get the whole city behind us, and the Norks won't stand a chance. Walker's a spark. People will follow him. We gotta get him back. Uh, we've been down here for a few months now. This is all part of the Broad Street subway extension. It was mothballed back in 21 when the city ran out of money. It's not on any of the pre-war maps, so the Norks don't know about it. And here you have it, Brady. This is the boot that's gonna kick the KPA's ass. Come on over here. But first things first, let's get some American steel in your hands. This is, uh, Sidney Cook. He runs the armor. Who's this? That's Ethan Brady. He was helping Walker. Walker got arrested. Yeah, but that wasn't Brady's fault. Don't worry about Cookie here. He's uh, generally in a pissed off mood. But he's a genius in improvising weapons, and that's why we keep him around. Ain't that right, Cookie? Always cooking up something new. <laughs> One day you're gonna make that joke and I'll shoot you dead. Then we'll see who's laughing, huh? Sidney, take it easy, will you? 
Brady needs a weapon. What can you spare? You can... Tap. This. If it turns out you show some aptitude, then we can talk about upgrading. I know you're thinking a pistol won't do much, but with one of Cookie's special conversion kits, suddenly you got yourself an SMG. A little basic. There you go. Now try converting your pistol. Transceiver intel. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. Don't worry about it. Paul's on it. Say hey to Brady. He's a new recruit. The resistance is more just frontline troops. It's What's up? People helping the best they can. Take Doc Burnett. He's a good example. That's not going to win this war, though. Top line is we got to build up our strength by expanding our red zone operations. We keep ambushing and raiding. That weakens the Norks and strengthens us. Eventually, we'll turn the tables. In the yellow zones, we're fighting for the hearts and minds of the people trapped there. We give them the belief that we can win, and when Walker gives the call, they'll rise up and follow. We only get one shot, though. We gotta be ready. Okay, I want you to head to the red zone. Dana will teach you how we operate. Out there, she's the best in the business. Just try not to piss her off, huh? Show me I'm right to trust you, okay? You don't want to go out there unprepared. You should take some Molotovs. Hey, Lorna, help the new guy out. Be best if you learn how to make your own. Grab some ingredients and give it a try. Okay, now just put it all together. Try making one. Okay, now you're set. Molotovs are great against their soldiers, but they don't do shit to drones or vehicles, so watch out for those. Elm trees down here. Good luck out there. Dana, this is Parrish. I'm sending you Brady. He can help you hit the KPA transceiver. Make sure you get the coordinates of every KPA operation in the area. Dana here. Understood. We'll get you those locations. As soon as we can reach the KPA transceiver, we'll download the data. Shit, Dana. We got a patrol. They must have switched routes overnight. You got any ideas? No time to go around. Let's hit him. Okay. Parrish wants you trained, and I guess I owe you for before, so you get to learn from the best. Just try not to screw things up. New plan. We're ambushing this patrol. Brady, best if you go with G-Man. Just do what he says. Try not to die. Come on, buddy, this way. And yeah, try not to die. Alpha, you got anything? Give me a second. Okay, yeah, Dana, there's barrel traps on Elm Tree Avenue just ahead. Brady, through here. Come on, let's hustle, dude. Just hope it works. They're approaching the marker. This is it. Ready on the barrels. Not yet. Wait. Now!
Julia, this is Isaac. We're flapping in the breeze here. Where are you guys? Isaac, we hit trouble. Be better if we split up. Everyone head for a transceiver. With luck, some of us will find a way through. Brady, I've uploaded a transceiver location to your phone. We'll try for the others. Good luck. Situation. You reached the transceiver yet? Parrish, we hit trouble. Had to split up. One of us will get there, don't worry. Okay, I'm counting on you. Transceiver. Acquiring access to it may grant us intel about the nearby stronghold and other KPA operations in the zone. How you doing? Brady, it's more. You managed to get to the transceiver. I'm impressed. We'll put that intel to good use. I guess Parrish was right about you. I'm gonna follow up a possible Walker sighting. You should familiarize yourself with our operation. We have our main weapon store. Introduce yourself. I'm uploading the location to your phone now. Billy Alpha, all available teams, listen up. We got Walker. We're gonna get him back. Bet your ass we are. I want everybody's eyes and ears wide open. Any words, any sign? Any sub-micro speck of information about where they've taken him, you report in. We got it. But we think we've figured out some ways to get inside. We've identified a structural weakness around the large air vents. Put a bomb on that and you can blow open a roof. Some people have suggested jumping a bike right over the walls, although I think you'd have to be crazy to try that. Finally, we saw some plans that seem to suggest some of these places have tunnels leading in, but we've not been able to confirm that. Whatever we can try, it's gonna be a tough fight, so make sure you're ready before you take one on, okay? Good luck, Brady. Where you at? Supply run in Elm Tree for Ned. You got something? Parrish wants all available teams on Walker's scent. Top priority. I hear ya. As soon as we nail the supply trucks, we'll head back.
we've set up a listening outpost in the wreckage of the Finstock warehouse. We cannot allow the Norks to listen in on our communications or let them pinpoint where we're storing our munitions. Get in there and take it out. You're on your own now. 